In the last election, Fianna Fáil lost 57 seats, in effect eviscerating the most dominant party in the state. Tonight we ask what happened to those 57 TDs, where are they and what are they doing? Ursula Halligan sent us this report. A party devastated. Three quarters of their members seemingly disappearing into thin air. But what befell these hapless men and women of Fianna Fáil? And did they deserve such a grisly end? I spoke to a man who many believe not only knows where they are, but who may have been instrumental in their disappearance. Good evening. My name is Ursula Halligan. Ah, Agent Halligan, you're one of TV3s, aren't you? Out in Ballymount, near Tala. Vincent, I wanted to ask you about Fianna Fáil. What's it like out there, Ursula? Is Alan Cantwell still out there? Mark Cagney? Tell me, is Martin King still doing that funny thing he does with the weather? Getting people to send in their pictures? Yes, he is. Vincent, I Tell Aidan to... Cooney I said hello, would you? I always liked Aidan. Vincent. But I could never read a whole one. Vincent, 57 Fianna Fáil TDs simply disappeared after the last election. You conducted a number of interviews with these You're people. so ambitious, aren't you, Ursula? I bet you couldn't wait to get out of that crummy little newsroom and get out chasing the big stories. Get out, get out with the big boys, getting out and getting all the way to TV3. You see a lot, Vincent. Now, what did you do with those TDs? Martin Manser once tried to test me. I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti. <laughs> Ursula! Ursula! Check the schools, check the dental practices, the Greyhound racing stadiums, the FOSS courses. Go to Tipperary, go to Mallow, go to Moscow. You'll find them, Ursula. Thank you, Vincent. You fly back to your newsroom now, Ursula. Fly, fly, fly. <laughs> <laughs>